What's going on my people? It's Tony from Food Sesh and we're back at it with another one. So I finally got around to going to Wendy's to get the pineapple under the sea frosty from the Krabby Patty combo guys. Now I know I'm a little late on this one, but like I told you guys in the Krabby Patty burger combo that I wanted to do it one at a time because if I did the burger before the frosty, the frosty was gonna melt. And if I did the frosty first, then the burger was just gonna be too cold to give you a proper review. So I got it right here, guys. I went with the small because I figured this would be enough to let you guys know whether I think the pineapple under the sea frosty from Wendy's is a hit or miss. So as you can see, it has some kind of liquid on the bottom. I'm assuming that's the pineapple flavor and the rest is gonna be like vanilla soft serve. And I guess you just have to mix it up to get that real flavor. But there's only one way to find out guys. I got my spoon right here. Make sure when you order it online, you go to extras and you add spoon and napkins. If not, they won't give you a spoon. And if you're trying to eat it in the car like the way I'm doing, you're gonna definitely need a spoon. So let's open this bad boy. There it is right there. Smells good. It smells like pineapple upside down cake, to tell you the truth. And I think that's because of the vanilla soft serve. So let's dig right into this bad boy. Let's see if I could taste any pineapple from the beginning. Cheers. Okay, I taste a hint of it, but I'm pretty sure you're gonna have to mix it up. Mm. I'm definitely tasting that pineapple, guys, and it's definitely tasting good. Cheers. Mm. Now let's give it a mix, you already know. Now that we ate some, let's give it a twirl. Let's mix that liquid that's on the bottom, that's I'm assuming, is the pineapple flavor. Let's get it, guys. You already know. Make sure you mix it when you get it so you can taste how it's really supposed to taste. Check that out. That's that drip right there. That's that drip. You already know. Look at that. Let's get it. Mmm. Mmm. I'm back guys, after having some of the pineapple under the sea frosty. And one thing I gotta say right off the bat is that you definitely taste the pineapple, but it's a lot milder than I was anticipating. As you can see, I mixed it up and I don't know if they didn't give me enough of the pineapple flavor, but I didn't really taste a lot of pineapple like I would have liked. You do taste the pineapple, but the vanilla soft serve definitely overpowers it which I'm a little disappointed in. They can probably add more liquid to make it more flavorful, but I'm gonna review this one as is. And so far, guys, I'm a little disappointed because I wanted to taste more pineapple. In the beginning, I did taste pineapple before I mixed it, and it did taste good, but once I mixed it the way you're supposed to, I kind of lost some of that pineapple flavor. So as far as score on the pineapple under the sea frosty from Wendy's, I'm gonna have to give this one an average 6.0 out of 10. And for me, it's gonna be a miss because I was anticipating a lot more pineapple flavor. I'll probably give it another try at another Wendy's just to see if this one was a fluke. Let me know in the comments if you got one like mine that didn't have a lot of pineapple or do they just come that way? Or did you get one that was really pineapple-y and you tasted a lot of pineapple? So let me know, guys, whether it's worth it or not to go back to Wendy's to try this bad boy again. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the review and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.